Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome uh, back to Chatting with Zim. Uh, we had to finish part one off before we got kicked out, so this is part two of uh, of my boy Ellie. Uh, Ellie underscore sketchbook. Uh, you definitely find him on Instagram. Follow him on uh, the YouTubes. Uh, make sure you guys subscribe to his channel. Uh, make sure you guys are following us, uh, Chatting with Zim. Just for all the previous. Uh, there he is, man of the hour. Let's go ahead and beam him up into back. Uh, let's go for part two. Let's go for a little bit more. Let's see what, what else we could talk about. Hold on. Hey, there we are. Yeah, you can see me. Yeah. Cool, man. Hey, so Ellie, man, thanks again, dude. Uh, Thanks again for doing this sure. uh, and joining me, dude, on the on the stream, dude. It's uh, I'm having lots of it's fun. It's always so appreciated, sure. man. You so got any children? You, said you had some? No, no kids. No. Okay. Married? No. Oh man, living the single life, brother. <laughs> Can't complain. Oh, no, no, not at all. Sometimes I wish I was single. Just joking, honey. Nah. <laughs> yeah, well, well, if you have uh, found the right woman, something no, a lot of people have. look for a lot of time. So, Yeah, you're right, man. Um, favorite character to draw, brother? Uh, definitely there, though. Daredevil? Yeah, for sure. What do you think of the Netflix, uh, the whole Netflix seasons, man? It was amazing. I'm so I'm so upset that it's, it's over. I think the uh, third yeah. season was one of the best. They had like a yeah, very interesting uh, spin on for Bullseye. Yeah. Yeah, that that was uh, definitely dope. Uh, I enjoyed the season. It was a lot darker than the actual movie. Uh, you know, the one I with Ben Affleck. Will... That was that was <laughs> terrible. <laughs> I love I loved it when it came out, but retrospect and thinking about it is pretty pretty trash. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it, it was very trash. No, but <clears throat> the whole Netflix series was uh, it's phenomenal, dude. I. Uh, I was like, man, this is what the movie should have been from the beginning. Definitely. Um, th did you uh, follow anything else like Iron Fist or uh, I, I any of the saw, other shows, Jessica Jones? I, think I watched them all. Jessica Jones, the first season, I think it's the best Netflix show. Okay. And the second season was not so good, and the third season was pretty good. What about uh? What do you think of Iron Fist and Luke Cage? Luke Cage was awesome. I'm pretty upset that they finished it so quickly. Iron Fist was just trash. <laughs> oh, you didn't like it? No, it was just terrible. Oh <laughs> uh, man! I I think I think the what the was actor it, the that character? played Danny, the, the 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 guy that played Danny Rand was terrible. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> they did a very bad uh, casting oh choice there. Okay. Yeah. Man, I can I came in it not knowing what to expect with Iron Fist. Um I know he he, he started getting a lot of flack for it, so which is funny, but I don't know, man. For me it's like that comic book geekiness from when I was smaller and just seeing this you know, live on TV, I think for me, it's always like, you know, it could suck, but it's always like, oh, my God. You know what I mean? But yeah, of course, I was a big, enjoy that, a big but fan of my interest. But in the end of the day, that the character was not working, the storyline was pretty boring. They never took it anywhere interesting. I think that they missed it. They definitely dropped the ball on that. They missed their mark. Yeah, it's my opinion. <laughs> oh, great. 
Entitled to it, my friend. Entitled to it. The Punisher was uh, pretty good. See, um, Punisher was badass. Uh, yeah. Ultra I, I want more. Gart and his style. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. I think I enjoyed the uh, the series as well uh, over the movies. Uh, I know they had uh, like two or three different spin-offs, so. Uh, the, they had like an 80s version, which was terrible. They didn't even have like the skull on the chest. Then they had the one with uh, in the 2000, which was an okay movie. But a very good, um, the guy that played the Punisher was... Right on the mark. And the third uh, one was terrible. The third one was the uh, the one where he was a little bit bigger guy, right? More uh, Yeah, the war more violent. Yeah, yeah, Ray yeah, yeah. Stevenson, I think, played it. Yeah, yeah. Now, that one was just more gory, which I liked, but... Uh, yeah, exactly, yeah. <laughs> you know? Okay, I guess. Uh, anything you're working on now besides the uh, the Wolverine? I mean, any current projects? I'm actually, yeah, I'm working on my own comic book. Oh, sweet, man. Tell us more about it, bro. Uh, it's actually a horror script, which I wrote for a friend of mine. She wanted to direct it, but she never got around to it, so... I'm working on the pages right now. It's like a alien thing. Don't want to spoil it too much. Uh, because I don't think she'll never do it. That do direct it. So I'm just making a comic book out of it. Oh, cool. But I'm doing it very slowly. I'm very disappointed with myself with that. No, I'm... Nah, man. No, no. No time like the present, dude. Um, so... I... I don't know if you if you uh, had a chance to listen to any of the previous guests, but uh, definitely I would recommend episode three at Delatory Comics. Uh, okay, he's also an upcoming uh, comic book artist. He's not only I mean he's my cousin, but you know he's also doing his own comic books. So I mean, if you ever need, you know, some sort of direction or whatever, I'm pretty sure you guys could you know link up and talk. I and, will. I will talk to him and check it out for sure. You know, I uh, I was hoping he'd be on today and too, but he was probably busy. But I'm pretty sure he'll tune in. He always listens to to all the interviews, man. And uh, that's one of the things about the show. Uh, you know, it's I I want to talk to you guys just not just so I could I can know you guys better, but also you know your followers, your fans, um, and you know other artists in the community, man. That way we could you know link up. You guys could network. Um, and that's what the show's about, man. Just growing, uh, sure. giving you guys, giving us the artists, you know, the, the, I mean, uh, giving us an outlet, you know what I'm saying? To, to promote mm -hmm. ourselves. And, and if you like it, man, I, I've been having fun, man. It's been a fun combo. Uh, it so I highly appreciate it, man. I will. If you, uh, you know, just for future reference, if you ever want to come back or you want to promote something, or just chat and shit talk a little bit, you know? I'm always, door's always open for you, brother. So remember that. Thank you. I will use it. Do you follow any, uh, any other comics, like, um, besides Marvel and DC, like Image? Uh, uh, I, I used, I do, I, I have, a, I have, like, a huge collection of comic books. Hold on, I think I could show it to you guys if you want to see. So, oh, there they are, dude. That's an awesome like a, collection. Dude. That's like a uh, Ultimate X Men two signed by uh, Adam Kubert. Sweet. Uh, that's Wolverine seventy five. Oh and hell yeah! I have. A, and I have like the darkness, uh, which is by Image, and War Heroes, and Kabuki, which is by uh, David Mack. By the way, this is the artist I was talking about. 
Yeah, I, uh, I definitely checked him out. I seen some of his Daredevil, his like watercolor, right? There's a lot of watercolor. Yeah, pictures. it's amazing. He's amazing. Yeah, he is. Yeah, as soon as I seen that cover, yeah, I know exactly who you're talking about. Nice little studio you got there, man. Thanks. Uh, so I have to go out now. But uh, thank you for having me. Ali, well, thank you. thanks again for, for being and, uh, and uh, sharing your time with us, man. Sure, for sure. And uh, see you around. And uh, hopefully we can do this again. Definitely. Uh, so as soon as we're done, I might put it up on uh, my YouTube channel and you'll be able to find yourself there. Uh, once awesome. again, dude, uh, thank you. Thank you for coming on. It was a fun time and definitely not the last time, all right? For sure. See you so around. Happy new, happy new Year and do do what you got to do, you man. Too. We'll talk happy later. Talk later. Bye. Bye. And there you have it, guys. Uh, this has been uh, Chatting with Zim, episode number 16. That was my, my boy, Ellie. You can find him on Instagram and on YouTube at Ellie underscore sketchbook. Um, make sure you go on his YouTube, subscribe, check it out uh, on his Instagram. Make sure you go out there, follow. Make sure you check me out. Check out some of my artwork. It's pretty dope. Shout out to Matt Crew, uh, MAC, Monstrous Art Clan. you find us here on Instagram. Uh, thanks again to Ellie. It's an awesome time. Great artist. If you guys haven't checked them out, make sure you go follow, share, uh, show the support, show some love, show some of that Zim love, guys. And that that's pretty much it. That wraps it up. Uh, i like to thank everybody for coming back, whoever came back. Uh, make sure you guys see, go to my go to my channel. There's a video of me uh, prior to doing the shows. There's a cool, uh, I guess there's a cool uh, fucking um, little giveaway I'm doing. Uh, first person to answer that question at the end of my personal video. I, I rap a little bit in there too, so you hear my raps. Um, towards the end, listen towards the end of that video. That's, I guess that's the only clue to what the, what the question is, I guess. And, uh, if you guys win, first guy to answer correctly, DM me, they get a free sketch card of your choice. Uh, well, it's free character and I'll definitely ship that out for you guys. Uh, and that's it. It's been chatting with Zen episode 16. Uh, at the sketchbook. Thanks again. Make sure you guys follow. It'll be on YouTube. Go check out the previous ones that I've done. And follow, like, share, love one another. And that's it, guys. Zim, out. I'll see you guys on the next one. You already know. Scott!